The Canyon School District has joined a class action federal lawsuit against vape device maker Jewel Labs. Fox 13's April Baker explains why the school district has joined the suit. Canyon School District staff say a lot of students' behaviors have changed in recent years in classrooms because of vaping, and e-cigarettes is a problem that doesn't look like it's going away anytime soon. 11 vaping devices confiscated in three weeks at Canyon School District. It's a trend that administrators say promotes bad behaviors among students. A lot of kids are starting to see what they can get away with because vaping is becoming easier to hide. Now the district is taking another step towards mitigating this trend. Yesterday, the Canyon's Board of Education decided to move forward with the mass action lawsuit that 12 school districts in Utah have joined. Attorney William Finnan with the France Law Group says the reason for this lawsuit is twofold. To hold Jewel accountable for its past conduct and addicting youth to their products and to provide school districts with the financial resources necessary to combat this vaping epidemic without putting the burden on taxpayers. Those funds are, are needed. Right now we're having to take school personnel time resources away from all of the things that we used to just do on a daily basis to kind of combat what's been going on in the schools with the e-cig and tobacco use. According to 2019 data, the Canyons District reported 219 school office referrals for e-cigarette use or possession. Meanwhile, that same year, Jewel Labs stopped advertising its products in the United States and discontinued selling most of its non-traditional flavored products after reports of more underage use. Fox 13 reached out to Jewel Labs for a statement on this suit. It reads in part, quote, we will continue to reset the vapor category in the United States and seek to earn the trust of society by working cooperatively with attorneys general, legislators, regulators, public health officials, and other stakeholders to combat underage use and transition adult smokers from combustible cigarettes. Along with Utah, 30 other states have joined in on this lawsuit. The trial is slated to start in March. Reporting in Sandy, April Baker, Fox 13 News, Utah.